Ohio State football team spending tonight in Columbus before leaving for Dallas tomorrow afternoon in the national championship game on Monday. Earlier this week, Buckeyes met with the media. 15 different videos from that session can be found on our Buckeye Insider playlist and the WOSN YouTube channel. Among the topics of discussion, Ohio State's defense, which has looked very good the last couple times out, going up against Oregon's very up-tempo offense. Even though the Ducks are a little banged up, particularly at the wide receiver position, Ohio State has a lot of respect for the Pac-12 champs. Urban Meyer admits he's been converted to an up-tempo guy. The Buckeyes know the key to attacking the Ducks is Heisman Trophy winning quarterback Marcus Marotti. Well, they have a really good player at quarterback, so <laughs> that will start there. But um, really, I mean, what we've seen on film with them is that they've, uh, they've eliminated teams by the fatigue factor. Uh, you know, some teams will be up on them, say, mid, late third quarter, and then they'll just blow the door open. Um, so what we've been attacking is just the fatigue factor and everything. I was a backup for a while and just a great kid, and I, I think that's so good for college football to see a guy like that and win it. Um, great, great player, great, great person, great leader, you can tell. Plays his best when it's hard, plays his best. You know, the Michigan State game was a perfect example. He extends plays, and he's the... He's the biggest challenge. You know, tempo offense is really hard, but tempo offense with an average player, it's not that hard. He's the one that uh, keeps the, the chains moving, and that's, that's when tempo gets you. We have two huddles running at us. Um, you know, you put the clock up there and you try to get it going as fast as possible. Uh, it's trained us to, you know, you make the play and then you get up right away and, and save the celebration for when we get off the field, turn right to the sideline, get the call, and then look at uh, what's going on on the field.